The next feature we're going to look at in our CleverShare feature is all about the desktop sync functionality. What that does is it, rather than allowing you to mirror from your device to the CleverTouch screen, it allows you to go the other way and cast from the screen back to your CleverTouch device. If I allow Gareth to then uh, request that functionality, you can see again with the permissions mode turned on, I have to accept that request from the front of the screen and then I'm going to start desktop syncing. So what will happen now is you can see that Gareth has an exact replica of whatever I'm doing on the clever touch screen on the device he has in front of him. This is really useful if you're in a classroom situation and you'd like the pupils to have a close up of what the teacher's doing on their own device. Or if you've got a child with a visual impairment, they can obviously see whatever the teacher's doing on their own individual device without the need for additional costly software. At this point, Gareth can see exactly what I'm doing on the Clever Touch screen. As I start to move this content around on here, Gareth should be able to see that content as a live feed directly to his device. Again, if I write on the screen, then this content will show up and Gareth can see this content on his device as well. A little further to take that functionality is if we tap on the little option at the top and view the main interface, from my little device list down here, we can see that Gareth is then uh, desktop syncing from here and what I can do is authorise touch by tapping on the finger option. That will then allow Gareth to be able to control the device and activate it and use it like a remote control from anywhere in the room. Again, giving the pupils the option to be able to take control of the content that appears on the screen or indeed utilise the tools that appear at the bottom of the screen, as you can see Gareth indicating there with the pen tool and being able to write on the screen. A further functionality he has is that he can also interact with the floating pen tool that sits on top of the screen. That way he can do things like tap on the house button, and then navigate around the different apps that appear on the screen or indeed take screenshots of different content that's displayed on the screen as well. So a really useful functionality. That's what we've been looking at the CleverShare application today that comes as a system app on your CleverTouch screen. There's no additional cost for that. Allows you to mirror to the screen from any device or from the screen to any device as well. Thanks for watching our video today. Do check out our other videos. We'll be looking at more features of the Impact Lux education screen.